Hello everybody, my name is Prodigal Lion, and welcome to Erica, a new video game that came out I think a few days ago on like August 19th or something, but anyway, it's a game that, it's more of like a live action, like it's actual characters, um, like actual people I should say, playing characters, and you like interact with it, so it's, it's similar to like um, Detroit Become Human and games like that in terms of how they play but it's with real people i hadn't even seen that this was coming out i didn't hear anything of it but then suddenly i seen somebody play it the youtube channel i follow um and i was like oh that looks neat so i didn't want i didn't watch any of it really i watched i think like 30 seconds and i was like yeah i want to play it for myself so i bought it it's only ten dollars so i recommend at least possibly buying it for yourself since it's only 10 bucks i thought it was gonna be like 30 40 but only a measly ten dollars and i am ready to <laughs> play this because it looks exciting it's like a interactive thriller so i don't right now it's prompting me to use the smartphone but i don't think i really want to do that this is an interactive story your choices from one of many perspectives no single path holds all the answers sounds like my type of game forever yours Oh, okay. This is so cool. Like everything you gotta do is used from right here, and you can see what I'm saying. Look, real actors. It's not. I, I I'm excited. Mmm, I'm excited. Okay, I'll shut up. Oh. Okay. Definitely an eerie beginning. That like a lampshade. Yeah, see, and like all this, I'm controlling. I wonder if that's Erica. Drag to explore. Ooh, that's neat. Okay. This is just so neat. It's so unique. Like a vaporizer thing, I guess. Like the music. Erica. Yep, that's Erica. You shouldn't play with it. It's dangerous. Oh, for protective. Okay, are you ready? Mummy and I met many, many years ago in a place called Delphi House. She was a nurse, I was a doctor. At night, I wonder if that's her mom. Stories. She'd tell me about the future, wonderful things. Things only she could see. Yeah, probably, yeah. Looks like they're getting married. And I tell her about the past. About a great priestess marked with a butterfly who could stare into the fire and see the future. Yep, that's her pregnant, so that's I probably her mom. She was magic, just like the priestess. I think you're magic too. But you're going to have to prove it. Pick a photograph. Pick your favorite. Oh, okay. So I want to go ahead and go with that one, just I guess. Now, close your eyes. Focus your mind. And conjure the power of the ancient priestess. Now find your mom again. See if you can guess where your favorite is. Does she have powers or something? I'm gonna turn the middle one. Nope. Oh, disaster. Don't worry. 
I still think you're magic. She'll always be with you. Remember that. Even though she isn't here, she's still a part of you. So she probably died. Ooh, what's that? A rasher. Marking. If you could stare into the fire and see the future, what do you think you'd see? What? current day probably so she was having a nightmare did that really happen or is it just so regardless this is her current day and that was her as a kid so that's probably just her having a nightmare of when her father died and her mother mother appears to be dead too That looks kind of like Amelia Clark. <laughs> looks very similar to Amelia Clark. <sighs> Reassure. It wasn't your fault. So yeah, that really happened. I want to know how she escaped that if someone came back in afterwards and held a gun to her head. I want to know what happened. Come on! There we go. <laughs> Who's that? Is it Halloween? Either it's Halloween and she's way too old to be trick or treating, or she's about to rob somebody. Oh, I don't know why I unlocked it. <laughs> I'm gonna help. 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 Do you need any help? It's crazy how so much how similar they look though, like this adult actress compared to the kid actress. It's crazy how it actually they're they're so similar looking. So she draws. That's her dad. That's her dream. I don't know what that is. Was the marking on his chest? I love this. I love the vibe of this game so far. Like this is so cool and unique. Up 
open. 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 Ooh. Was that a body part? And that's the marking that was on his chest. Whose hand is that? Miss Mason. I'm Sergeant Blake. The lead investigator on this case. Okay, I was about to say, she just totally moved on from that. Can I see I was going to be so surprised. I promise I'll give it back. Rip out. You draw this a lot. It's Greek, isn't it? The Delphic Epsilon. Same as with your father. It was on the medallion, too. The hand belonged to a Cal Jahar. He worked at Delphi House. I believe you visited there with your father. What does this have to do with me? Your father's case was never solved. He founded Delphi House with a man called Lucian Flowers. We think he might be a target too. We're keeping watch over at Delphi House. Protection detail. I'll be leading the investigation from there. Right now, it's the safest place for you too. So is she still a target? Same thing, I would love to know how she escaped in the first place. That's... That's her dad. Oh, so she's that's her remembering what happened and she's returning to this place. With is that the cop too? Yep, that's the uh agent. I like tapping bells, damn it! Leave me alone! They're probably God, out for smoke. Prevent me. Wait here, I'll go check. I wonder who they're waiting on. Is this just a hotel or something? I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Over here, maybe? Oh, that's her dad. So what's the significance of this place? Why'd there be a painting of him with that guy? Hmm, is there anywhere in particular I'm supposed to be looking at? Uh What were those? I want to go to the phone. I'm going to the phone. Your father's not who you thought he was. 
follow the music. Find Elodie Carter. See what he did to her. See him for who he really was. Why should uh -oh. I trust you? You shouldn't trust anyone. Find Elodie Carter. See for yourself. Elodie Carter? Who's that? I'm gonna go through the private no entry. Hey, cool, I picked it correctly. Let's go to the radio, I guess. So, is Anity Carter in this room? Let's check in here. up um, let's look at the typewriter from the also office of K Steinbeck Delphi house there mr. and mrs. Johnston I uh, wanted to read that dear mr. and mrs. Johnston it is with great sadness that we extend our condolences to you and your family tiara was such such a delightful girl even at the end, she faced her challenges head on, and despite her circumstances, which were never less than difficult, she remained true to herself until the last. Please find along with this letter her possessions, which which we are happy to return. Please find and close multiple clothes, personal items, numbered ashtray, bro. Okay, crazy pictures, blanket. So, is there something stored in this room somewhere? Check one of these drawers. It's been ripped. Oh wait, what's this? It looks like there's something hidden underneath. Come on, I can't really seem to get it over where I'm trying to get to. What's that say? Check this drawer, I guess. There's the key, okay. Let's grab the key. Let's get into that caged off area. I don't. I, I want to know what the point of that notebook was. Because it was just random for her to draw over it. It looked like it was going to say something. And then she just puts it up. Alright. Looks like we're going to go check this out. There's a bunch of files. Lodi. Is that the person? Aladai? I don't know. Oh, is that her mom? 
Record of termination. I'll, I'll let it. Erica Mason. Okay, so Erica's her middle name, and she's named after her. Committed to impatient ease by senior resident physician. Admitted. Um, I guess we're going. I didn't know where we could even go, so I'm just running run over here. I guess. Seems like it was the smart choice. <laughs> Got me right outside. Uh, well, this doesn't look like there's any good decisions, though. Ooh, that scared me a little bit. Hey, Foxy. Erica. What are you doing? I told you to wait. I, I forgot she was even here with that guy. There was a phone call. That was a phone call. It was a woman. She knew who I was. She said... She said... Inside. Now. We need to find out where that call came from. Do whatever it takes. What are you doing? Get over the phone. There you go. Yeah, go on. So this dude shows up this late. <gasps> what is your that logo? And you? I'm right to see your identification. This is a private facility here. You can't just walk in. Not I'm police. Not a policeman. What are you then? I'll call you back. I'm Sergeant Blake. I called this afternoon. I'm supposed to meet a Dr. Ballard. I can only apologize. I'm all a bit nervous here. Sergeant Blake, I'm Rosa Ballard. I suppose you already know Chief Inspector. Doctor, thank you. Would you mind taking Erica up to her room? I'm afraid I need to speak to the Chief Inspector. There's been a development. Okay. I suppose you don't remember me. I don't really entirely understand what's going I worked on still. With your father. I used to look after you when you were little. You knew my parents? Of course. Your dad taught me everything I know. And your mum, she was incredible. Brilliant nurse, so smart. It's funny. Anyway. This is you. You might recognize it. Really? Mr. Steinbeck, the night manager, will be downstairs if you need anything. Well, this is a very unique room. So we're gonna have a flashback to it, okay. Looks like that's her mom again. Is this his luggage, possibly? Hmm. What is all this? Oh, it's another record. Okay. Okay, that's his thing of records. Is this the same song I was playing at the beginning? Kind of sounds like it. Why does she seem like she's... I can't tell what she's feeling.
What's this say? What's this say? Erica. It says Erica right there. Why does it say her name? Oh, did she do that? Look under the bed. Uncle Lucy got you something. It should keep you out of trouble. Present from him. Huh, look, a little do toy doll. No, oh, come on, open up. Wait, what am I supposed to be doing? Jump, jump. Eh. Wait, why would it be... I have it unlocked. Oh, huh, that's all I had to do. I just didn't respond fast enough. Pull the doll on out. Look at her on. Has the same thing on her arm that as hers. I want to know what the significance of that is. Having more flashbacks of him being killed. Yeah, see, uh, I want to know. It keeps... I just want to know what happened. I'm sure I'll find out eventually, but... I want to know what happened. She keeps having these nightmares and flashbacks of his death, so... I mean, I'm sure it'll all come together piece by piece. Seems like she's holding her stomach or something. Ooh, why she had that big bruise? I probably shouldn't have done that, but man. Oh. Uh, she was so dead set on me not walking through there. What? What? <laughs> Confront. Can you put that out? It's upset you. Do you want to come here and talk about it? Come on, Toby. I'm trying to play. Leave the girl alone. Whatever. Hey, Deathwish. Over here. Well, at least that girl's friendly. Oh, one ain't so nice. She's got emotional problems. I can tell. Hurry up and die, Hannah. She seems nice. Yeah. It's not her fault. I blame society. Me too. <laughs> Me too, yeah. man. I blame society for my issues as well. See this bit? It's simple. Four notes. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Huh. I'll do the rest.
I'm so out of sync. Two people can create music together. How sweet. Ooh, what's with the blood? Whoa! What are you doing? Here we fucking go. No, 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 no cleaning! No cleaning without supervision! Kirsty! Kirsty. It's okay. She's right. Can you maybe go and get someone? What the hell just happened? Where did all that blood come from? She said that's new. Kirsty likes to be the center of attention. She's all wide-eyed innocence until she doesn't get her own way, and then it's... <laughs> Stop that! <coughs> that's a lot of damn blood just to act like it's not that big a deal. Need it in the main office. Thank mm -hmm. you.